farmers are inherently good at passing information about their local environment down from generation to generation. But it seems increasingly likely that young farmers are going to see circumstances that our parents and grandparents didn't necessarily see. We were asked as USDA to look at the vulnerability of the food supply to climate change. Which meant we could start mining all of the data that we have. And when we started thinking about mining data and being able to have somebody in the private sector work with us, Microsoft was there. Microsoft and the USDA are rolling out an innovation challenge, which is really a call to action for developers around the world to start digging into some of the key data sets that the USDA has been collecting over the past hundred years on crop production practices, financial outcomes, demographics, and remote sensing products of the health of crops around the country. The innovation challenge, I think, is just one of those exciting outcomes of this whole climate data initiative, and that is creating public-private partners like Microsoft to actually create and do something new and different and to make these data sets available to the larger public. Using data and information and transferring knowledge between people who aren't necessarily co-located close together gives us an opportunity to improve our practices based on their understanding that we might not otherwise have had access to solutions that answer some of the key questions that the USDA has about how to ensure the resiliency of America's food supply. Now that's what I think Azure Services brings us. It's a way to connect the dots across all of these different, different sources. Having a healthy farm economy benefits everybody. Bringing all of those different kinds of data together is going to be difficult. It's going to be a challenge and that's why we're asking people around the world to help the USDA solve this.